everyone. Today we are going to visit the Museum of the History of Marseille. Pass through this garden, you will get into the ground floor level of the museum and the main entrance of its door. Right, Marseille is a very ancient city with um, a long history, um, dating back from the 600 BC. That time it was a Greek city, actually a Greek colonized city called Massalia, a Phoenician city. Now here the museum is well laid out in chronological order. If you follow the years, the history of this city will be shown to you clearly. All these ornaments were dug out from uh, archaeological sites in different parts of the city. Mostly, they are Greek era remains. There is no shortage of boats, ships, and all sea related products. There are also Greek vases, amphoras, sculptures, little ornaments. More amphoras here, and lots of uh, flat screen televisions, which you can show the map of the cities from ancient time till now. This part is about the Roman root era. Lots of tools and utensils in the Roman times can be found here. Some of the burial sites Can you guess what these are? They're actually man-made oven for cooking at the time In the further corner of the ground floor level, you will find lots of sculptures with the theme of Christianity. As this city has always been a Catholic one from ancient time till present, you can even play a game to test your knowledge of the city. On the left hand side, there is a table which you can choose which product come from which part of the world here. So we are going up to the first floor. First floor, you will find the city is no longer a Greek one, but it's part of France. And it will show you each monarchy, especially Le Huasule. Le Huasule is the Sun King who was actually Louis XIV. He chose his own symbol like a sun with rays shining all over the land of France, hence the name. His reign of 72 years and 110 days is the longest record of any monarchy of a sovereign country in European history longer than the Queen Elizabeth II in Britain, who has been on the reign for 68 years as of 2020. Here it also explains the French favorite expression, c'est la Gali, when we say that we are in Gali, that means we are in a very bad situation. This comes from 
the ancient time till the 18th century, the galleys were both actually for the evicted criminals to serve their sentence. In 1564, a new law was implemented, and the duration of this penalty was at 10 years. So these criminals were tied and uh, whipped in the boat. They had to row hard to move the ships forward. So we use this as an expression to uh, express we are in a bad situation. This part is the more the Mark say, Savula tour. That means Mark say is famous for the soup product. And of course, seafare products, navigator or ships. So when we come out of this museum, we go back to the main street, Kohoi the same family, and at the end of this street, one street off it is Kohoi Kenyo. When we see the famous Louis Vuitton bag shop, just directly opposite that shop, we will find the museum continue. When entering the courtyard, we find the temporary exhibition on the ground floor. At the time, the theme is fashion and mode. Climbing up to the first and the second floor, you will find uh, paintings of abstract surrealism, expressionism, cubism, and pointillism, such as this nice painting, pointillism, by Sigmund. The theme is the port of Marseille. works by uh, Picasso, you will like it here. Abstract Expressionism. And uh, we will find a few uh, installation arts here also. interesting artworks here and these are probably done by ink if you can choose I suggest you come here on a weekday because weekend is a kill here and uh, you cannot enjoy or read the description of each painting in peace. You will be bothered or obstructed by someone else, usually. So, um, if you can choose, try to avoid to come in the weekend. Late today, I come here on a Sunday. It's a bit crowded here. It's got two floors. It's actually a very small museum. You probably spend 45 minutes or less than that to go through all the artworks here. And uh, on coming out of this museum, we can leave the city center and go to the eastern part of the city to explore another two museums quite close to each other. So thanks for watching today. Bye.